But I wanted you to start with this metaphor, one that we often hear about, but I want to probe it a little bit further. You know, the, the, the great words of Dr. King, who said that the arc of the moral universe is long, but it bends towards justice, right? So we've heard that many times. Now, he, as much as anyone, always understood that an arc bends more quickly, more effectively, when pressure is applied by people who define their lives by the pursuit of justice and dedicate it to its pursuit. And when I see all the people here tonight, the young folk and the folk who've been with us in the trenches for years and decades, I am reminded about this arc that we are helping bend. And so I take incredible optimism out of the fact that it's from our staff and from our volunteers and from our supporters who really have been pressing at that arc to have it bend more quickly toward justice. Now, if you've ever played with an actual arc, let's say a bow and arrow, you know that when you bend the arc, it tries to snap back, it tries to bounce back. And that it's not simply a question of applying pressure to bend it. It's also making sure that in an unguarded moment, as you arch it back, it doesn't just snap back at you. And so here I want you to think about this metaphor in the context of civil rights and civil liberties in the US, that the bow is indeed trying to snap back. And it's a backlash that threatens to redefine and diminish what it means to be an American. And if we're not careful about how that bow could snap back, we could do ourselves greater harm than, than we envision.